Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is 1 power of x is equal to 3. To find the value of x from this equation. Now, in the first step, we'll apply natural log in both sides. So, by applying natural log, which is ln in both sides, it will be ln of this, which is 1 power of x is equal to ln of 3. Then, this power of x will move to the base. So it will be x ln of 1 is equal to ln of 3. Then we'll divide by this ln of 1 in both sides. So this ln of 1 will cancel this ln of 1. Then it will be x is equal to this ln of 3 over ln of 1. It is 0. Now, any number ln of 3 it is 1 point something 1 point 0 something something so any number divided by 0 it is undefined so there is no real solution for this value of x into this problem so we write here no real solution so if there is no real solution there might be a complex solution so to check for complex solution for this value of x, we will solve by using Euler's formula. So from U from Euler's formula, which is e to the power of i theta is equal to cos of theta, then plus i sine of theta. Now, by checking this identity of Euler's, this Euler's identity, we'll check by substituting theta is, is 0. So, for theta is equal to 0, here we'll substitute 0, it will be e to the power of i times 0, theta is 0, then is equal to cos of theta, which is 0, plus i times sine of theta, it will be sine of 0. Then it will be e i times 0, it is 0. Then is equal to cos of theta plus z i sine of 0. Now e to the power of 0, it is 1. Is equal to cos of 0, it is 1. Then plus sine of 0, it is 0. 0 times i is 0. So into here 1 plus 0 is equal to 1. So, it is, this Euler's formula, it is good, or it is satisfied to solve into this problem to find the value of x. Now, by substituting i into this, because we are finding the complex solution for the value of x, so we we'll substitute this i, because when we substitute 0, the i will not exist. So, by working with i, we take theta is equal to, 2k pi whereas k is equal to integer is element of integer so that k is equal to 1 2 3 and so on so we'll test it for this k is 1 2 3 this only now from our theta is 2 pi k we'll substitute into here theta which is 2 pi k here here and here so our equation will be e to the power of i, so e to the power of i times theta, which is this 2 pi k, so here times 2 k pi, k pi, then is equal to cos of theta, it will be cos of 2 k pi, then plus i sine of theta, it will be i sine of 2k pi then now for so here for k we start with k is equal to 1 so for k is equal to 1 then it will be e e to the power of i here it is 1 right i mean k k is 1 so here we substitute 1 so it will be 2 by i so here you can write i times 2 pi then is equal to cos 
here it is 1 it will be cos of 2 pi then plus here it is 1 it will be i sine of 2 pi then from here cos cos of 2 pi it is 1 then sine of 2 pi is 0 0 times i it is 0 so when we take 1 plus 0 it is equal to 1 so e to the power of i to pi it is equal to 1 now we check for we already check for 1 so now we check for 2 so k is equal to 2 then it will be e to the power of i here we substitute 2 so it will be 2 times 2 is 4 so it will be 4 pi so times 4 pi is equal to cos of 2 times 2 it will be 4 pi so cos of 4 pi then plus i sine of 4 pi then for here cos of 4 pi it is 1 plus this it is sine of 4 pi it is 0 0 times i it is 0 so 1 plus 0 it is equal to 1 we already get 1 this is equal to 1 then now again we test for k is equal to 3 then it will be e to the power of i times k here it is 3 so 3 times 2 is 6 6 pi so it will be 6 pi is equal to cos of this it will be 3 times 2 is 6 so it will be 6 pi so cos of 6 pi then plus i sine of 6 pi then also in here cos of 6 pi it is 1 sine of 6 pi is 0 0 times i it is 0 so 1 plus 0 is equal to 1 so our conclusion we can see this is equal to 1 equal to 1 equal to 1 so from this this e to the power of i 2k pi is equal to 1 so this is our conclusion so from this formula this formula if e to the power of i times 2k pi is equal to 1 this is not a final conclusion this is just we are checking by identi this identity for i so as you can get the complex solution so if this e to the power of i times 2 times k times pi is equal to 1 this one it is this here 1 so into here 1 we substitute this so it will be e to the power of i times 2 times k times pi then bracket this power of x then is equal to this which is 3 then in the next step we'll open this bracket so it will be e to the power of i times 2 times k times pi times x is equal to 3 then we'll apply ln in both sides same like this one so here it will be ln of e to the power of i times 2 times k times pi times x is equal to ln of 3 then from here these powers will move to the base so it will be i times 2 times k times pi times x then times this ln of e is equal to ln of 3 now from this ln of e it is equal to 1 so here it will be 1 times this it is the same thing but we are finding the value of x so we'll divide by this except x this so it will be i times 2 times k times pi in both sides so here i times 2 times k times pi so this and this will cancel then it will be x is equal to ln of 3 over i times 2 times k times pi so this is the value of x but to make it look better we will multiply by i in both sides so here we multiply by i and here we multiply by i by 
rationalizing the denominator so we multiply by i in in the numerator and in the denominator so it will be x is equal to this i it will be before i then times ln of 3 over this 2k pi so here 2k pi then i times i it will be i square which is equal to negative 1 so if we, it, in the denominator it is negative 1 so we can write here negative so this is the value of x in this our uh, problem but for this k because it is in the denominator k should not be equal to 0 because when k it is 0 then this value of x for this complex solution is not is not it is undefined so k should not should be should not be equal to zero and also k should be element element of an integer except zero so this is the final answer for the value of x in this our uh, problem thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye